Welcome back, everyone. Here's proof. You're never too old to be a superhero. Annette Benning is signing on for her first comic book movie. All right, she's a four-time Oscar nominee. She's joining Brie Larson in Captain Marvel, Marvel Studios' first female-led feature film. How awesome is that? Joining me to weigh in on all of this is Ebony Steele and Jeff Schroeder from Daily Blast Live, which airs 2 p.m. right here on 11 Alive. I'm a big fan of both of you guys. How are you? Hello, Christine. We're a fan as well. How's it going? Thanks for having us. We're super excited. I am so excited, and I know you're going to be talking about this. What do you think? Annette Benning is about to be 60 years old. It kind of proves you're never too old uh, to, you know, tackle anything. Yeah, why not? Coming off the coattails of Wonder Woman, why not have an all-female cast? You know, it's never too late to be a superhero, like you said, and uh, I think it's going to crush in a box office, and uh, I mean, hey, if you're going to sign up to be anything, be a superhero, especially if you're an actor, it pays. Why not? And I think, you know, I've heard her even say that this is really exciting for her because this is something different that she's never done before, so I think that we're going to see, um, I'm sure that, that she'll portray that on the screen as she does in so many of the other great movies that she's been in. I think it's a, a, a really great movie. Move. You guys, it's such an exciting time. Um, just women power all the way around. I have loved Annette Benning for years. She is just one of those actresses that, I mean, well, has stood the test of time with her talents. Um, and now just proving that it doesn't matter how old you are, she's talented and she is going to be um, just a force to be reckoned with in this movie. I'm so excited. Hey, do you think that as we get older, more, do you get more ambitious? Less ambitious? Um, I, I, I think I've seen, well, first of all, she had her uh, last child at the age of 42, and we're not going to say older. We're going to call it more seasoned. How yes, about that, Christine? As we get <laughs> uh -huh, more seasoned. Um, and she has to be, I mean, she's married to Warren Beatty. You know, they got money out of, uh, out of the wazoo. So she's <laughs> definitely doing this. I mean, she could sit at home and chill if she wants to. Yeah. But uh, this just goes to show how she is, her body of work already speaks for itself. Yes, but this is what she does. Some people are made to do certain things, and I think she was born to be this actor and take on new and exciting roles and to motivate the w women as well. And there's so many, you know what I mean, there's so many role models for everybody out there. We're coming, Black Panther's coming out now, Wonder Woman's coming out, and what, there's no superhero that's an older age, you know? So right. I think this is a great opportunity for women to be like, hey, I'm not too old. I could get up and do something myself. So it's a great role model experience, and I, I mean, I'm personally looking forward to it. I'm a huge Brie Larson fan as well, so the cast is great. It's going to be a great movie. Well, Jeff, I didn't hear the last uh, 20 seconds of what you said because my producer in my ear was going on and on and on that he's a huge fan of yours. He loves you too, Ebony, but I guess he used to watch you on Big Brother. Lance says hello. Well, Lance, hello. And Christine, you missed, it was very intelligent <laughs> what I just said. It was well-spoken. You're going to have to watch it back because it was riveting. Okay, you I will. It. Okay, guys, Heart wait. Shattering. I love that you're also going to talk about this trending story. Uh, parents at one South Carolina high school could face a fine of $1,000 if they cheer at their kid's graduation. People are obviously upset, but I gotta be honest with you. Have you been to a graduation lately? Those things go on and on and on, honey. Let's keep it moving. Keep it moving. Right, and and we gotta correct you just a little bit. It's not a thousand dollars, but how much, Jeff? Exactly. One thousand thirty. One thousand thirty dollars. Oh. Don't forget about that third. There's thirty dollars. <laughs> I don't know where they came up with that number, so but uh, random. if you do. I'm with you. If it's a huge, you know, they just had that thing down in Florida at Florida University. Um, they were, you know, rushing people off the stage. If there's a, you know, if you have 5,000 kids in your graduating yeah. class, you don't want to be there all day. Right. But as a, if you're in high school and people are cheering a little bit and they, you get a thousand dollar, thirty thousand dollar fine. Mm -hmm. I mean, good luck collecting that money is my, know, my point. Yeah, <laughs> you wonder how you're going to enforce that. And I know when my parents came to see me graduate from college, even if they told everybody, sit down, don't make a move. Yeah. It took me six years to get my bachelor's. Don't worry about that. Don't worry about the other two years. I had other things to do. But they're going to yeah. scream and jump and down, up and down because they're just happy that I'm getting out of there and out of their pocketbooks. Now, that is true. That is true. Guys, thank you so, so much. I could talk to y'all all afternoon. Uh, we so appreciate your time today. Have a great show. All right. Thanks, Christine. Thanks for having You're us. You're awesome. All right. Thanks, guys. Be sure to check out this topic and others. Daily Blast Live, 2 p.m. right here on 11 Alive. Aren't they fun?